Wow. Here we are on the Mayflower. Just a couple months until we get to our destination. Hey, how about a song to pass the time? Well, we're heading to the new world. We're going across the sea. We're gonna meet the natives there. I bet they're gonna be really cool. We're all gonna be best friends. There's no way that this country will be disappointing ever. We're never gonna hurt anyone. We're never gonna take advantage of any people. I bet we're gonna all be best friends forever. Time. <laughs> That's it, yeah. I knew I, I had I'm, to be, I knew I had to go dark humor with Damon, are you ready? Yeah. Okay. Uh, this is my impression of me mm -hmm. when I was 18 months old. Mm-hmm. Oh, 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 God. Oh, God. <laughs> I like to think this is how I woke up. Because you died. He, he drowned as a Because he toddler. drowned at 18 months. <laughs> Hi, I'm Big Bird, and this is an alternate universe where I was in the Challenger disaster. <laughs> oh my god! <laughs> Oh, hello, Courtney. It's me. It's me on the top of your list. Quick, let me paint you a picture. There you are, waking up in the morning feeling so good. And then suddenly, oh, what did you do in middle school? Oh, no, it was really bad. Oh, and then, wait, suddenly your day is ruined. But I like that. Hello everybody, welcome to Pita Palace. Thank you for coming, where we make the pitas your wildest dreams. Okay, now I know why you're all here. This competition has been very fierce. Thank you all for coming. Here are the results. Ooh. In third place, uh, coming in at uh, about five million, it's Poland. Now in second place, uh, just under 20 million, China. This guy's a read it off his phone. And finally, uh, just under 24 million, it'll be the uh, Soviet Union. <laughs> Congratulations, Soviet Union, you have won the casualties for World War II. <laughs> <laughs> oh, you said he likes that stuff. Wait, I, I think I missed something. That was, uh, that was Ian's joke, which country uh, had the most casualties during World War II. Oh, okay, but why is he dressed like a pita? Uh, uh, we, held the, we held the competition at the pita palace. <laughs> Truck sleepover. Twuck sleepover. Twuck sleepover. What's your favorite sleepover trick to play? My favorite sleepover trick is to put a, a cup, put the hand in a cup of water, but for the truck, it's putting water in the gasoline tank and seeing how big it blows up. <laughs> I like putting sugar in ping pong balls into the truck. In the, the tailpipe? The tailpipe, yeah. Yeah, it's pretty cool. I put the potato in the tailpipe. That's pretty cool. My favorite truck prank is to drive it into closed garage and leave it wanting with the windows open. A 2009 car crash led to a very public cheating scandal for this world-renowned golfer. Angela. Tiger Woods. It is Tiger Woods. Knew that. Wow. I knew that. I was gonna say yeah, Princess Diana. Yeah. <laughs> I don't know. That'd be awesome. <laughs> I, know, I have Wait. a small library of car crashes in my brain. <laughs> Golfer. It's the perfect answer! <laughs> she could have been good at golf, we don't know. <laughs> don't know! To honor the New York City landmark that occupies it, Congress changed the name of Bedloe's Island to what in 1956? 9-11 Island. <laughs> <laughs> I laughed, but you will have to answer to Jesus. <laughs> I will get in trouble! <laughs> Who here is a survivor of childhood leukemia? Why do I not go with oh my, my gut? God. Why do I, I go with my gut? Is it your gut or are you just saying Peter every time? I'm just saying Peter, Peter every time. I love you so much. Wow. Oh.
That means a lot. Thank you. <laughs> does, that mean okay. we, does that mean that we have to be like nicer to you now? <laughs> I'm super I nice guess. to Peter. It's kind of in the contract. Okay. I mean, I was treated at Children's Hospital of Philadelphia. I like was diagnosed at like 11 months and then pretty much wrapped up by like four and a half years. So I like peaked in preschool, which is pretty exciting. Whoa. What does that mean, wrapped? What? Like, like when to remission. So like yeah, oh, was oh. in clear. Leukemia takes a long time for kids. Wow. Did you get a make a wish? I did. I went to Disney World. Pretty exciting. Nice. But yeah, it was more like my my family's deal. I didn't. I don't remember anything except the Disney World. <laughs> yeah, he really wants to go to Disney World. <laughs> <laughs> he wants you to pay, pay off the uh, old Lexus. He wants a Porsche, real bad. <laughs> <laughs> no, I meant the cancer was my family's thing. Yeah, that's what they're the ones with it. <laughs> wait, wait, what? Okay, now you. Like, I don't remember like me. anything of it. <laughs> no, <laughs> Wait, what? he doesn't remember having okay, crazy leukemia. Pitch. <laughs> oh, he doesn't. You don't it remember. It was their whole deal. Mm, yeah. I didn't really have to do. You much. don't remember. Yeah, it, I, I didn't. Wasn't. I didn't put in that much of an effort. So you're a gift. <laughs> Subconsciously, at least. I don't you're know. so remarkable. You're a gift. Wow, thank you. <laughs> Did Michael Jackson hear a smosh before he died? <laughs> I don't even understand. <laughs> What overlap window the is thing there? Was, the yeah. thing was, before, before when Michael Jackson was alive, I had never heard of Smosh at that point. So I just wanted to make sure you know, I'm always trying to see where we're connected. Oh, I don't God. think he's ever heard because we're too old for him. We're too... <laughs> yeah, yeah. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> no, because we've been around no, for so long. No, yeah. no, 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 no. <laughs> Oh, hello, Kimmy. <laughs> On your mental illness. <laughs> Brain, boot up. Analyze our body. Overanalyze our body. Okay, we don't like it. Have a good bad time. Goodbye. Context clues. Yeah. Red and blue are in there. <laughs> I went to school. <clears throat> Guess the princess Diana. That's my favorite quote. Okay, okay, I'm excited for I'm excited for this one. Are you paying okay. attention? Yeah. <gasps> one of my favorites. Oh. 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 Uh, Diary of Anne Frank. <laughs> Pro probably. What is that? What is that? Okay, that, that was a good guess. It's okay. It's okay. It was that a good is guess. a movie. It was we're a good scared. It was a corner. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Just, yeah. Wait, just so wait. Just wait. And the attic you all vibes. It's, I got okay. it. I got okay. it. Okay. It was okay. a good guess. It was just insane. Okay. Yeah. <laughs> okay. And we will be clipping that for, for YouTube shorts. <laughs> Finally, 2001. <laughs> It was March of 2001. <laughs> and that was the year that Courtney and I began our research. So that's why that's important. That's all we got to talk about. <laughs> that <year. laughs> Say what you will about pedophiles, but at least they drive through school zones slower. Hi, I'm Kevin Spacey. Welcome to my TED Talk. You're still going! A second Lego tower has hit the stream. <laughs> Shit. I'm surprised nobody's photoshopped a tower hitting, like two planes are in the air and a tower's hitting one of them. Whoa, a third tower has hit the tower? <laughs> third tower has hit the plane. Uh, <laughs> Suspect, October 16th, 2022. Could I substitute OJ for the milk? Ew! Ew! What? Dude, no, you can't! You cannot do that! I mean, maybe you can, we just tried it and it worked, kinda, but no! We're oh. definitely dealing with a court case here. Oh, man! This, this is That's a crime! That's a layered joke for you at home. This is a crime! <laughs> You're funny. <laughs>
God damn. No, so I should have known it was OJ. <laughs> we should have. We should have known. And so another mystery has finally been solved. The case of Keith's weird ass cancer. <laughs> Complete. I'm so sorry. No, he threw my tumor. <laughs> hey. Yeah. No, I get it. No, that's that's crazy. Are we going to the movies? I didn't even get to the punchline. Okay, do it. Anyways, yeah, I. I still can't believe your dad was Saddam Hussein. What was John Wilkes Booth doing? <laughs> what? What? Come on! What was John Wilkes Booth doing when he was... <laughs> I mean, do I get that? <laughs> what was John Wilkes Booth doing when he interrupted the comedic play, Our American Cousin? <laughs> this is great. Can, can, can we get it clear? Can we get it clear? <laughs> what was John Wilkes Booth doing when he interrupted the comedic play, Our American Cousin on April 4th, 1865? He was crocheting. <laughs> <laughs> That, that's a laugh. That's a laugh. That okay. counts. Sir, what does he answer the question? <laughs> what was he doing? He was fucking assassinating the president. <laughs> oh. That's, it's absurd. But like, is that the answer on the card? <laughs> like, no, read it. No, like, wow. Well, the what's the actual answer? <laughs> Keith, the answer is assassinating Abraham Lincoln. Well, okay. <laughs> <laughs> Oh, <laughs> hello, Shine. It is me, your mental illness. I see, I see you're having a good day so far, but have you considered not having one? <laughs> okay, see you once more. <laughs> see, I, I just don't even, I don't even think that I could name 10 movies. Lord of the Rings, Fellowship, uh -huh. Twin Towers, uh -huh. Return of the King. I was about to say sequels don't count before you even started, but you know what? We're, good. we're it's here. It's two Let's towers. It. Did, it, did I say Twin Towers? <laughs> oh no. What did you do when you were with your arms when you were a kid? You drowned. <laughs> <laughs> he had to be revived. It's funny. <laughs> oh my that god. Is funny. You didn't do jack sh with him. <laughs> you drowned. <laughs> Hello, everyone. I know today's kind of a strange day. I think we all knew it would come, but not this soon. I mean, let's be honest, if we were betting, we all thought we'd be here for Keith first. <laughs> Fuck you. Let's do the next one. Oh. Oh. <gasps> oh my god. Oh, Russia. Bro! Oh, Russia! <laughs> Bro! Oh, Russia! I can't believe they already ran it over. Look. And then they're hitting it with <laughs> Now they're hitting it with Look, a hammer. It's all fun and games. It's not a real baby. We're just, we're just but toying we didn't with know it. That. It looks pretty real to me. It oh, looks... No, it looks like practice. I'm worried. I'm really worried about Arasha. Yeah, I'm really I'm, worried I'm, about. I'm, it. I'm, I'm, we need to they, talk. We need to teach, talk about Arasha. Is this what they teach at Emerson? Probably. I guess so. Because hey. they, they did not teach this at ASU. They're teaching us to have fun, mm. and and enjoy concepts that you're not actually going to do. You're just watching for fun. You guys know there's a niche audience for this kind of material. Yeah, they're called psychopaths. <laughs> Then I'll accept the diagnosis. All right, you heard it here. All right, I'll just get that door for you. There you go, and we are off. Nice night for a drive, eh, miss? Tonight, of course, being August 31st, 1997. <laughs> Any particular music you want to listen to? Princess Diana? <laughs> Oh 
There was a whole second bit I had planned with Courtney where you find out she's still alive and everything's fine. I swear. <laughs> what is the date of free Slurpee Day? Courtney? July 11th. That is true. It's 7 11. 11. Oh, that makes sense. 7 -11. Never forget. <laughs> no! No! A pentagon, the food pentagon. The pentagram That diagram. is incorrect. That's uh, crazy. Nobody gets it. The answer is a dinner plate. The official name is my plate. It shows different food groups represented by portion sizes. Oh God. And you know what? They replaced that in 2011 and we were too busy thinking about something else. Yeah, we were too busy uh, party rock anthem. Hashtag swaggy. Oh, yeah. But it's what not about the shit. What do you think happened in 2011? 9-11. Were you thinking 9-11? No. 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 Angela. Angela. No! Angela. I was wondering if that's what you were talking about. I like to think that she somehow <laughs> didn't know and someone showed her a YouTube video of the footage and she was like, I can't believe that happened today. Oh, that's Angela. not good. Hey, 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 hey. I had, I think, two sips of coffee before this video, okay? Which island country has a map of itself on its flag? 9-11 Island. <laughs> I hate that it works. I know. Where were you at 9-1-1? They hit the Pentagon. <laughs> Jesus. No more of this. No more of this. My God. Oh my God. Come on, Dad. Oh my God. Did that get you? That one got me. Put it in, Coach. Yeah, boy. Ew. A second log has hit the net. This person is That's dumping. Awesome. <laughs> My sister is pregnant. I'm gonna be a dad. We're so Wait a close second. to getting him. Ew! Up. You guys are so close to getting Ew, him. Ew, that's so <laughs> gross. <laughs> Hello, it is me. I'm in the airbase. Remember the time you hit a flower the child with your cow? <laughs> you should think about that before you go to sleep. <laughs> Mm -mm. All right, <sighs> and we're off. Sure is a nice day for a drive. Today, of course, being June 28, 1914, at around 10.45 a.m. in the morning. Wouldn't you agree, Archduke Franz Ferdinand of Austria? <laughs> hey, look, a teenager. Uh-oh, what's he pulling out there? What's he got? Oh, no, it's a yo-yo. <laughs> this is an alternate timeline where you were never assassinated, thus resulting in World War I never happening. That would then lead to a one-world government led by none other than, you guessed it, Matthew Perry. <laughs> Keith is so childish because it's his only way of getting close to Michael. Oh! Oh so my God! It's his Whoa! Way of close to <laughs> <laughs> Let me know their name. What's their name? Ashley. Ashley. Oh, what? Ashley what? at All Hell King. No, I just want you to know if I see you on the street, <laughs> we are fighting. That's that wrong. Was real That's good. wrong. Good. That's my wrong. Are the ones that ricochet and hurt someone else. Right? Like it's, it's like, like you think really Keith's getting hurt, us. but Michael got hurt. That's yes. That's the problem. <laughs> Don't hurt me, but don't hurt Michael. Personally, I don't think there's enough evidence to say there's a crime. Mm. I, I, I would tend to agree. I think this might be a mistrial. I, I mm. think, I, I mean, I, or, or <laughs> I don't think a crime was committed in this case. Mm. I think this person got away with it. All right. Though so I do think after this, we should write a new law, right? We should put a law so no one else does it. But you, <laughs> yeah. you get away with it. Yeah, oh. this sets the precedent. How, How likely is this clown to get accidentally hurt? <laughs> Face. I just watched Keanu walk up to the screen, just go like, 
<laughs> hey. Yeah, I mean. Yeah. Nice, Courtney. I'm saying, dude, don't do that. You're going to get hurt. <laughs> <laughs> It seems pretty obvious <laughs> that you don't want to do oh that. God. <clears throat> oh, oh, Amanda Lehan? Oh my God! I've been a fan of yours for so long. Mm. I, I'm not sorry. <laughs> sorry, I just get so excited. Oh my God! You, one thing I love about you is your aura. It is so tall. It's tall like the Empire State Building. The Twin Towers, damn it. <laughs> those, those mean people shouldn't have done Twin Towers. <laughs> the Twin Towers, those mean people shouldn't have done that. Okay, performers, let's line up. Tonight is showtime, dress rehearsal went great, and guess what? It's so important because the president himself, Abraham Lincoln, is gonna be in the audience. Oh my oh god, my god, 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 To literally blow his mind. <laughs> Guys, this is gonna be the best performance of Pippin he has ever oh, seen. We're gonna kill it. Oh we're going, we're going to, kill to kill it. it. We, there are no plot holes in the head of this play. People uh -huh. will remember this night forever! Yes. I'm going to f***ing assassinate the president. <laughs> 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 oh, hello. <laughs> it's me, a mental illness. <laughs> How are you today? <laughs> okay, I hear you're having a good day so far, but here's a bad thought. Oops. Uh oh, you're clinging on to it. <laughs> uh oh, don't let it spiral out of control. <laughs> Looks like it has. I feel so good. <laughs> Okay, well, have a good bad day, and I'll be back hour by hour. <laughs> good evening, this is your captain speaking. Uh, we are uh, having a wonderful time coming in. Uh, <laughs> after this transatlantic voyage to Lakers Air Force Base on the 6th of May, 1937. <laughs> I'm sure I speak for all the 61 crewmen and 36 passengers when I say it's been a pleasure having you aboard the LZ-129, a.k.a. the Hindenburg? Did Raven see 9-11 coming? Okay, listen. If she could see into the future, if she could, <laughs> if she this could, was pre, was pre is it her fault? It, <laughs> that's the headline. Is 9-11 Raven Simone's fault? Yeah. It's like um, can we get any close for that question? Yeah, I'm people, asking again really close. I don't think it is. <laughs> I don't think she could have done much about it. Imagine if there's an episode of That's oh Raven my God. and she sees this. What is she supposed to do? Call the Pentagon? Hi, I'm a teenage girl and I can see into the future. <laughs> okay. Keith. <laughs> Did Michael Jackson do it? You broke it! <laughs> good night, stars, good night, air, good night, noises everywhere. And that was good night, moon. Sleep well, ma'am. You have a big day tomorrow. Tomorrow, of course, being September 8th. 20 and 22, the year of our Lord. Good night, Elizabeth Windsor. First of her name. Oh my God! Oh. You'll be queen forever. I just know it. <laughs> Bye. Bye. Oh, I was like, who's Elizabeth Windsor? Uh, she's the queen that died. I only know her first name, Queen. 9-11, I'm high. No. <laughs> no, no, no. Oh, 9-1-1, I'm high. See, I'm so used to, see, now you know what the next Google search will be. 9-11, I'm high. This is your captain speaking. I just want to thank you all for flying with us on this gorgeous weekday. Today, of course, the date being not that important because there's nothing 
important about today. Actually, there's not one important historical event that I can think of that happens today. Anyway, if you take a look to your right, you'll see the beautiful New York City skyline. <laughs> take it in, all the skyscrapers. Yep, nothing bad can happen today. <laughs> What's that? What? Just kidding. Brace yourselves. It seems that a bunch of geese have flown into the engines. So we're going down. Fasten your seatbelts. Oh my God. Oh. 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 Today is January 15, 2009. That could have gone way worse. We love you, Tom Hanks. Hey guys! Hi! Oh my god, it's so nice to have all of you in the same room at the same time, finally! <laughs> um, okay, I actually don't have a bit planned. It's more about feedback um, before we get more into the funnies about anything. There are quite a few things that we like to joke about. They're a little controversial. And so one of those controversial things that we like to talk about is 9-11. <laughs> <laughs> So with 9-11, um, <laughs> as we all know, it's very impactful for a lot of us. And I don't think all of you know this, but I'm a native New Yorker. So I was alive when 9-11 happened. I know, I remember when it happened. Um, and it's one of those things where I, it, it comes up and it, it triggers a lot of memories for me. Actually a very personal, very deeply personal story. Deeply personal story. It's a little hard for me to talk about. <laughs> Guys, it's not a joke. <laughs> serious, serious feedback here. Um, when I was living in the Bronx, my father actually worked at the World Trade Center at that time. And um, it was a difficult time because I keep thinking about him every time we talk about 9-11 and how he didn't make it to work that day. He actually overslept and it was very difficult for me to understand about. <laughs> So every time we talk about 9-11, I want you all to know what I'm going through in my lived experience. So think about that the next time you joke about it, because it is a tough lived experience. In our next bits, let's just keep in mind my lived experience. <laughs>